I feel this person right now, yes, they have a lot of deep emotions for you, all right? But they're keeping things on hold right now between you guys, okay? Something stays very stuck and stagnant for you guys. I think right now this person is in that very entrepreneurial mood, okay? I feel that they are wanting to pursue something, okay? And I think they're very, very focused on their business right now, their career, or they're pursuing something that they're very uh, passionate about, a hobby, converting into a business, something like that. I think with the mood here, this person has a lot of deep feelings for you. But again, they're putting you in the back burner right now. You are more so on their mind, yes, but probably in the nights when they miss you. But otherwise, I think they're keeping themselves very, very busy throughout the day. What's the king of wands? What's the king of wands? What's the king of wands? This person is very busy transforming themselves right now. They're very busy transforming themselves. There has been an ending between you guys, all right, for sure. This person is trying to make a lot of changes right now, okay, in their life, in their uh, career, their goals, uh, in the way they approach things, in the way they thought about you, their belief systems, okay. There's a lot of alterations that this person is going through right now. And uh, like I said, this person is going through a huge change in their life, okay, a huge uh, part of the life has ended. I feel you guys were a at a very pivotal point in this connection and the ending has caused a lot of changes within them, okay? It's like the universe has forced this person to take like a 180 degrees turn, you know, in their in themselves. And I feel this person is working on themselves, okay? Trying to work on their courage, trying to work on their um, decision-making skills, trying to work on uh, not caring so much about what other people think, trying to be more assertive and trying to be very... Um, uh, assertive about what their opinion is you know like they're not letting um you know what i'm saying right yeah but i don't think you're they, you're on their mind as much but i think they are they think about you at night is what i'm getting it's a hangman there's a hangman here yeah uh this person like i said again this person is very busy uh building something for themselves i think building a stable future uh building probably collaborating with people teamwork okay one other thing i'm getting here that things could be stuck and stagnant between you guys because this person is trying to avoid listening to other people's opinions which they used to all this while and now they're seeing things from another point of view they're trying to analyze and try and see things from every different uh, way, okay? Or trying to see things from every different point of view so that they can have a more clearer picture about what's really going on. So I feel work and other people's opinions or people were just overall just coming too much in between you guys. And now this person has finally taken a break from this connection here. It's on a pause. Uh, but yeah, now they're trying to work on themselves is also what I'm getting here. I don't know. A lot of themselves. I don't think that focuses you. Moon. What's the moon here? Yeah, they're constantly thinking about you. They miss you a lot, okay? But again, I'm getting here more of less of you probably in the nights, okay? Or probably when they're absolutely lonely. But otherwise, they're very busy pursuing something that is a, a business probably, okay? What does this person feel? What will this person feel for Pisces in the next 24 hours? What will this person feel for Pisces in the next 24 hours? Too? What will this person feel for Pisces in the next 24 hours? Ace of Swords, Six of Wands, and the King of Swords. I think this person does want to communicate with you, okay? But, but I feel that they are thinking very logically right now. They're trying their best to uh, keep their emotions in check, okay? This person is someone here who's definitely always a head over heart person, okay? So could be dealing with an air sign. This is someone here, you know, who's a massive overthinker also is what I'm getting, okay? They have a tendency to keep overthinking, overthinking, overthinking. I feel right now... Yeah, I think this person, till the time luck is not on your side or till the time there is these delays are i feel this person is still not wanting to do anything or not taking any solid action to come towards you i think they're just waiting for the wheel of fortune to come in their favor they're waiting for the wheel to get into their favor it's like they'd rather focus on something that is working out for them rather than focus on the connection which is ended right now and where things are still not working out i feel this person is very focused on themselves not you okay ace of swords what's the ace of swords 
for some people i'm getting this person's mother could be another issue okay i don't know why i got that what's the ace of swords hmm this person out here wants to talk to you but they're still indecisive because the kind of decision that this person needs to make it's going to need a lot of planning okay this person out here is someone who's at a crossroads okay now this is a huge decision a life-changing decision that they have to make do they want to um consider this connection as done and over with whoever was at fault whether you or them do they want to do that or do they genuinely want to come towards you make you a solid offer and uh take things to the next level yeah but i feel they are very confident that the wheel is going to turn in their favor and there's like a 180 degree shift that's going to come into their into your connection that there's a lot of positivity in this person's mind okay but when you're asking me honestly this person is not thinking about you right now you're not on their mind i think it's more about their business their career their goals everything but you pisces again i'm not getting a third party situation where they're involved with anyone else because i see this person is very goal oriented right now they don't have time for this shit but yes in the night when they're alone after they're done with the entire day they only think about you and all they're thinking about is how do i approach pisces what do i do what's my next move what should be my next move okay but yeah they're thinking very deeply about what to do next and this person could be you could be waiting on a decision from them okay but uh, they're being very logical about this okay and they're wanting to make a very head over heart decision this time uh king of swords what is that what is the king of swords here Suits. Suits. Ah, see, uh, this person is very stuck in their head. Okay, I think this person is already stuck in another situation that they can't get out of. Because of that, they need to be very harsh and cold towards you. They're they they they're not going to be able to communicate with you right now. But whatever the situation is, they need to get out of their head. Okay, so whatever situation is keeping them trapped. it's it's i feel like this person is keeping themselves trapped in that situation okay by thinking logically and not thinking emotionally when it comes to love okay the the issue is when you're thinking more logically in love you know that's when all the mess up happens right because other person is thinking more emotionally and the air signs think more logically or they're overthinking us right uh which is why things turn sour okay they're they're very closed off they don't like to you know they're very confused right now so i feel right now they are just wanting to stick to what they know stick to what their head is saying rather than what their heart is saying because too many options or too too much on their plate right now okay and they refuse to look at this connection right now okay if they've left it to the universe is also what i get what action will this person take towards pisces what action will this person take towards pisces in the next 24 hours What action will this person take towards Pisces in the next 24 hours? Please? The tower and the action position. Someone got this. Someone got this. I think um Sagittarius got this in the same position in the action position. So we have the four of swords, the knight of wands, and the tower here. This person right now is going absolutely restless. Okay, again, could be an air sign. This is someone who's overthinking. Okay, thinking about the situation over and over and over again. They are going nuts thinking about you. They want to rush in towards you. Okay, they want to. But I feel that it's the overthinking. it's uh their approach towards the situation where they're not really wanting to get into the crux of the problem here they're just trying to you know solve the problem from the top layer which is trying to distract themselves or trying to tell themselves oh it's over you know i can't really do much about it etc so for a soul what's a for a soul they they the, the way the way they're going about right now they're definitely they're definitely heading towards burnout okay total exhaustion here what's the for a soul here what's the for a soul I feel this person doesn't rest. They they don't rest. This could be someone who's a workaholic. I think but they're definitely needing some more time. Yeah, very focused on their work. Very focused on their work. You are on the back burner, Pisces. I'm not going to lie. You are on the back burner. Re reconciliation is on their mind, but right now their focus is not you. Their focus is their money, their stability, their financial independence or they're just being on their own. Okay, they're okay on their own right now, and they're single, by the way, Pisces, for the ones who are wanting to live there with someone else. So, if you know that your person is with someone else already, then this is not for you. Okay, this is for the ones who are either just not sure or they're just, you know, 
assuming that the person is with someone else. This person is definitely single. Okay. Knight of Wands. What's the Knight of Wands? <laughs> knight of Wands with the Knight of Swords. Look at that energy, Pisces. Look at that energy. Look at the way they want to rush. But this is what the problem is, right? Both these energies, they come in with so much passion. They have so much passion. They have so much to say. They want so much action. They're so action-driven, so passion-driven. They can't sustain it because they're still coming up as a knight here. So when it comes to you, that's they're coming up as a knight. But when it comes to their work, they're very mature and showing up as the king of wands here, okay? So I feel their work, their career could be going through a huge transformation right now, okay? They could have ended a certain career, go, gone through towards a completely new job a completely new industry a completely new field okay which is taking up too much of their time here okay and that's what i'm telling you they think about you but only when uh, they're not busy or when they're uh, in their work but right now this person could be having a lot of success okay a lot of success in their life probably a lot of public recognition also you could be dealing with someone who's very very uh, who's in the public eye you know everyone knows a lot about them okay um but this person wants to not only rush and passionately, but they even want to come towards you and communicate with you. But they're holding back. They're holding back. Again, why? Because money's on their mind. Could be someone here who's always chosen money over relationships. And that's why probably you put in all the work all this way. And that's why there was an ending here because you were fed up. Tower, please. Why is the tower here? This is some drastic... What's the tower here? Uh -huh. This person is trying to wait. Okay, right now they 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 put in uh put a stop in investing into you. This person's not wasting their time right now. Actually, that wouldn't be the right word. They're not investing their energy into you right now. Like I said, right throughout the spread, I haven't got that this person's thinking about you and they're going all you know like where spicy is. No, this person is trying to um avoid a mess. They're trying to avoid any kind of chaos and destruction that they can cause if they come towards you. Why? Because I feel that one, I feel this person sees you as someone who's given up on them. Okay. Or this person out here is just waiting to see if things will come to fruition. They need some time here. Okay. This person really needs some time here because with the tower here, this is in their actions, which means that this person is very afraid uh, of a disaster. Okay. So they're trying their best to avoid a disaster from happening okay they want to rebuild this connection but they want to take it very slow very very slow okay and that's why they're holding back this person see ten of swords just came out whatever ending has happened between you guys right this person is trying to have a deep analysis about what really went wrong and how they can make things better but before they come towards you they have other things on their mind Okay, they have other things on their mind. This is also overthinking, over exerting themselves. Right now, I feel this person feels like a victim out here. They feel you did the you did something wrong to them. Okay, now again, no, don't, don't have to put in the comments below. They did the wrong thing. I am sure they did because the spread looks like that. But I feel like this is how they feel. Okay, this is how they feel. They feel they are the victim out here. They feel nothing's going right in their life, or uh, at least, especially when it comes to you, they lost you. Um, you know, so it's like you know what. Instead of, I mean, some of it looks like a little bit of ego, okay? It's like, well, it didn't work out with Pisces, you know, never mind, okay? But you know what? I mean, I still have my work, so I'm just going to try and focus myself into work. No matter how miserable miserable I am without them, I'm still going to show the world how okay I am, okay? So that's a little bit of arrogance and overinflated ego that I'm getting from this person here. This person is wanting to choose a new direction, not like someone else, but it's more like, okay, if that didn't work out, if love didn't work out, I'm going to focus on my career. You know, that's what I'm getting here. But um, they want to, they want to talk to you. But there's a lot of holding back from this person here. Okay, a lot of holding back. They're waiting and watching, waiting and watching. Okay, because this person um, knows that there's a drastic approach that is needed to completely shake up the connection between you guys so that you guys can have a new beginning here. But right now on their mind, I think they are trying to be very logical and analytical and trying to think about what they want to do next with you. But I don't see them missing you and having sleepless nights or, you know, going nuts about you in the next 24 hours. All right. So that's what I have for you. I hope this reading resonates. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.